Hi everyone. In this video, I'll be showing you how to use your iPhone as your Samsung Smart TV's remote. So the first thing you want to do is go to your iPhone and go to the Apple App Store and find the SmartThings application. Now this app is by Samsung and all you have to do is install it. It's a free app so shouldn't be any problem getting it installed onto your iPhone. With the app installed, just go ahead and launch it. Now it's going to ask for some permissions, which you might have to grant. So like to connect to devices on your local network. Now, one key thing before you try to set this up is make sure your iPhone and your smart TV are connected to the same Wi-Fi network. So having done that, then you can now continue the setup process. Add services to your smart life, basically setting up the smart things app for the first time. And then to get started, you'll need to sign in with your Samsung account. This will be the same Samsung account signed in on your smart TV. So I'll tap on sign in. And then I'll sign into my Samsung account. And once you're signed in, it should take a minute to load up your information. And that's it. So the SmartThings app is set up on your iPhone. So now we can go to Devices, select Add Devices, and it's going to look for devices to add. So what you want to do is select Scan for nearby devices. So it says SmartThings would like to access the microphone. Just tap on Allow. It's going to search for devices. And as you can see, it's detected the Samsung TV. So I'll select that. I'll allow that while using the app. Now it's connecting to device. So there's a verification there, code, a verification code. So I'll enter that. And once I'm done, I can just tap on done at the bottom there. Once your Samsung Smart TV is successfully added to the SmartThings app, you can start using your iPhone as a remote control. You'll have access to various controls, including changing channels, adjusting volume, navigating menus, and even powering the TV on or off.